what's up everyone it's tvb um it's you've come a long way and yeah today's my last day like tomorrow i am off to scout camp and right after that i'm off to college so this is like my last like official day before leaving and yeah i'm here today at the jcc where i've been doing krav maga it's a this is my self-defense class really it's what it is. I've been doing it since December. It's a lot of fun. I've been wanting to show you guys what's been going on over here for a while. And I asked my instructor, like, hey, can I bring my camera? And he was like, sure. So, yeah, we're going to do that. I'm going to show you guys the zoo that I worked at this summer as well. And, yeah, just, really, it's, it's been a last day. Just, you know, a recap of what's been happening. Yeah. Um, no, that was that was that was that's how much this stuff here is on your shoulder. It's an explosive one on your shoulder. Oh, side. Uh, yeah, I guess you're breaking everything, right? Uh, move all the way up. Ah, that does make more sense. Yeah, so you get a slide. Yeah. Jacob, make sure when you fire the hook, because that's what you're firing is a modified hook. Don't miss, don't hit it like this, because you'll snap your wrist. Get your elbow up so everything's parallel. Oh. Don't punch it between the tits. It's a face shot. You're, you're like hitting right here. Yeah. 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 Y
Go slow, but actually punch him. Okay. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of body Yeah. Is that nice you uh, yeah. Unfortunately, yeah. yeah. So you constantly rain for here. Right. Well, that and that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, that's not. Yeah. Okay. So it's not yeah. always necessary. Yeah. 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 I don't know if that I have to do Maybe it switches to not a So literally, I'm out here. So we're here at the zoo I worked at, Turtleback Zoo. And uh, I've wanted to show you guys around this place for a while now. This is the day to do it too. And yeah, crap, my guy, it was all good and fun. Just thought I had to leave it behind. But yeah, here we are. All right, so I'll see you guys when we're in. No, sadly, I did not work with the penguins while I was working here, but what's up, guys? Um, I'll show you guys all the spots I did work at. Hi, penguins. Standard American diet, also known as SAD. Alright, so here we are on the butterfly garden. I was stationed here a bunch of times. Yeah, I got a lot of pretty butterflies. And pretty co workers, what's up? <laughs> yeah, I got like. I got. I've had, I've had butterflies sit on my head for like over an hour. I've been pooped on by butterflies. I took a shower, I felt it. And yeah, we, they get fruits. Because um, they, their diet's completely sugar. Like, they have a mouth that's like a built-in straw. It's called a proboscis. And yeah, they, um, this isn't a really good example, but yeah, they, they suck the juices out of it, and we also pour Powerade over it. And yeah, I, I, I would convince, I, maybe I should have convinced my boss to like put Red Bull instead of Powerade, but I was too afraid to ask. Hey! How are you? It's my last day. How are they doing? Oh, actually, no. Yesterday was my last day. Sorry, I'm just here today to visit and give Jen the shirts back. That one is twitching. This is just when they crash from the chrysalises, their wings are wet. Oh. So if we didn't have this here, they'd just kind of fall on over. Yeah, we got. They love the entrance for whatever reason. The butterflies. Hey, John. <laughs> I brought my camera. Do you have anything to say to the camera? Um, why are you filming? My last day. It's like a last. I, I leave tomorrow, so it's my last day vlog. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know any good bison jokes. Leave me your best bison joke in the comments, okay? Over there is the pony barn. It's funny. Like every, almost every morning, I'd clean the the stalls at the pony barn. Hey. But like, but with the the horses, like I would never get stationed at Pony Barn. 
Sorry, I never like let a pony ride. It's weird how that works, I guess. And over here, <coughs> sorry. Now, this way we got into our like South American theme section, where it's all a bunch of South American animals. One place like yeah. Wait, there's a Rhea, I believe I pronounced them. They're relatives of ostrich. They got capybara over there. Oh, there's a tortoise right there. Yeah, he's huge. Probably got a better view of the capybara from this angle. Yeah, I actually got to pet one of the capybaras. Because one was taken in for, um... For like a vet inspection or something like that, and and she was knocked out. So yeah, we got I got a very lucky chance to pet a capybara, and I got to jiggle its belly and like touch its feet and like do all sorts of cool things. Yeah, tortoise really loving them grass. Eat that grass, tortoise. Heck yeah. So every morning we'd start here, and you could get stationed at the goats all day, but I only got the goats as like an all-day station once. And really just make sure that, like, they're because you can feed the goats, you make sure that no one's feeding them anything that's like not healthy for them. Basically just the pellets, and I love goats. They're essentially like puppies with hooves. So yeah, this is where we'd start when we were assigned a different... Not a day the zoo towards a screaming kid. Okay, uh... Yeah, and oh, look! There is Damien the Ram. He's one of my favorites. Yeah, really loves to ram. That's why he's called a ram. Hi, Damien! Damien, smile for the camera! Damien! Alright. And in. Oh! Wait, where's my piggy? She just oink, 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 oink. oink. Now so much. She's like, ree, 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 and turkeys. Wow. These little babies, like they got wow. names because, because they got different rest, like bands on their feet. Like that, that one I think is just named Yellow. Yeah. The other one's a black band, and his name's just Black. And the other one just doesn't have a band, so their name's Brian. Let's see. Oh, over there is Feech the cow. Yeah, even though she's a female, she has horns. So we're a weird world we live in. I guess just it all depends on the breed. The cow goes Shazu. Look at how beautiful this jaguar is. Hey, kitty. I think we have a male. His name's like Rico, and the other like we have two. You know, try and get him to breed, like, conserve his species and whatnot. Man, he is... They're, it's just so pretty. Pretty kitty, you're a pretty kitty. I love jaguars. This exhibit, like, I mean, I know this is, this should be way bigger, but... You know, for a small zoo, it's it's pretty decent size. Like, we can have a jaguar, like, that's such a privilege. And over here... There's a jaguar. Over here we got some mountain lions. Oh, look at this! Right up against the glass. Hey, kitty! Psst, psst. Kitty, 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 look at the camera! You're a pretty kitty, yes you are! Kitty! You're a kitty. Oh, perfect shot. Hoots I give none! Kitty! Hi, Bobcat. Bobcats are cute. Where's Where's it going? Hi, kitty. Hi, kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. Oh, say can you see? Bob now, my friend here thinks I shouldn't be here because apparently it's my my day off. And I can't come and enjoy the zoo on my last day when I leave tomorrow. What do you have to say to that, good sir? As a senior in college, so much more to do. Thank you, sir. Very well. Okay, my friend, can we so have yeah, I got I, I got stationed at the aviary once. Yeah, I got this bird stick. I can feed the birds what I want. No, I only got stationed here during the day once. You know, basically make sure no one steps on the birds. Sure. 
but at, like in the mornings, Scott, say hi to the camera. Hey, what's up? So like, like I would um, I would like clean this place up, you know, scrub the things and wreck the place up, refill the, the food bowls, all that stuff. Like everything you've seen here is from Australia. Um, I apologize if you can't hear me over the constant chirping and kids screaming. Hey, birdies! Birdies, there's so many of them. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, mom, get the camera. Get the camera. Wait, I'm holding a camera. Mom, get the camera. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's see if we can, get, let's see if we can take one for a stroll. Come on. Get on my stick, bird. Oh yes, yes, yes. Kangaroos. As far as I know, they don't make any noises, kangaroos. But my sister, when she was little, they say kangaroos say hop, hop, hop. Not the case at all, little sis. My God, the leopard's actually active for once. He's usually um over there. <clears throat> well, that viewer is is a Siberian leopard and a moor leopard. Leopards in general, they're doing pretty well compared to the other big cats. But the more leopard is like one of the rarest cats on the planet. Like the subspecies specifically, like you only find like eastern Russia and they're like really endangered. So I'm so grateful that we have one here. I gotta love snow leopards, the ghost of the mountains. Ghost of the Himalayas that is. Yeah, we got two of them. They're pretty close. I think they're brother and sister, or they're just related in some way. Yeah, they're just laying down. All right, good night. Sumo! It's Sumo the baby gibbon! He's so cute. Like, oh wow, Peaches the alligator is actually moving around. And why do we? Why did we name an alligator Peaches? Uh, don't ask me. Your guess is as good as mine. Oh, I love alligators, they're so cool. I think it's kind of cute when alligators walk on land because their legs are so stubby yet they're so big and scary. It's like, blap, and they walk. Hey, peaches! Do you smell something tasty, peaches, or are you well fed? I was looking at him move. You can tell he's from the age of dinosaurs, even though he's not a dinosaur himself. So neat. Here we are at the hyenas. Hi girls. Yeah, we got two hyenas. They're both their names start with K. That's all I remember. They're, they're sisters. They came over from Germany. Funny story. This is like one of our newest exhibits, the whole African complex. Hi, sweetie. Oh my god, they're just gorgeous. Wait, go. You guys are in for quite a treat. <laughs> they really go up against the stage oh, like really? this. Uh, yeah. Fun fact, hyenas, female, the what is the, the rare case, like, well, I think the only case of mammals where the female tends to be bigger than the male. Yeah, hyenas are the ultimate feminist society. It's crazy. Look at that. It's like they're staring down at something, like it's ready to get fed. Sweetie. That is Demarcus the lion. He's another new arrival. We have two other lions, well, actually, lionesses, two females. Like, he's from Sacramento, and our two female lions are from a, are from the Bronx Zoo originally. They're a mother and daughter. Like, the mother's Sukari, and the daughter's Amara. And yeah, they're not gonna let him out with the females just yet because he's still very young and foolish and they're worried that the mom's gonna kill him if they do. Imagine if you're wearing like a blanket right now. So yeah, be really happy. he's say he can't be out with the females just yet, but hopefully they will so we can have some baby lions. I was stationed here at the lions and hyenas once. Yeah, j just once because that was before they got these signs that said no climbing. My job that day was basically stand around here, you know, by the lions and the hyenas and make sh and answer any questions from the visitors and make sure that like we don't have another Harambe incident. Because they can still bite you through that fence. 
if I wanted to. And I'm Ah, the giraffes. Yeah, I didn't know why they're called. Yeah, this in, like this is a fairly new exhibit. Like I think it opened last year, the year before. And uh, it instantly became one of the most popular exhibits here. And those are Maasai giraffe. They're the biggest out of all the giraffe subspecies. And we lost a giraffe recently. His name was Hodari. May he rest in peace. But, like I, I think that's a giraffe feeding station. I suppose. Like I'm pretty sure we opened it up. They never need my help for it. But like. Yeah, I think it's open. In here we have our sea turtles. Hey, sea turtle! Oh, I expanded the tank. That's cool. Hey, buddy. Yeah, this is our sea turtle recovery center. So for this, sea oh, oh, he's being fed. What's up? So yeah, um, we um, rescue sea turtles. You know that were injured, caught in nets, whatever it may be. And yeah, hopefully it'll get released back into the wild. So here we are at the reptile house, and yeah, here's our python, I think her name is Rosie or something like that, but yeah, she's massive. Did you see what she's getting fed? Oh, she's scary. <laughs> and over here is Shu. I kid you not, our Komodo dragon's name is Shu. Don't ask. Okay. Uh. Oh! Einstein! This is Einstein the Sloth. They have like a South American themed section over here. Oh yeah, over there we have some turtles. We got a cannon lizard in here too. Yeah, Einstein, he's so precious. Where are you, Einstein? He's out of his usual spot too. Usually he's over there looking hungover, but like, he's actually having a snack. I was stationed here quite a lot. Like basically, yeah, we got a bunch of counters raised. And you put your hand close to like in the water like this and eventually they'll swing up, swim up to you. Hey, hey fishies. Hey fishies, hey. Ah, come on. We gotta move in a more high traffic area. Oh wait, it's Ginger the Shark. Hi Ginger! Yeah, we do have one bamboo shark named Ginger, and yeah, that's the biggest they get. Hi Ginger! Sugar! Sugar, hi Sugar! Hi Sugar! Baby. Oh, that. Getting sassier by the day, she's over a year old. Cute little thing. And these are my mates. What's up, guys? I, I'm so tempted to tell people, get your kids' feet off the ledge. <laughs> and like, I got, I'm, I always went for a squeegee and started wiping the place down. I wonder if I'm too big to fit in these. <laughs> Any kids in here? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, walk. Sorry. Uh, oh, wow. Ah, jeez. I see the light. Yeah. Oh, nice. I'm next. Come on out. This prayer guy don't have my head. Wait, wait, wait. Kids, kids, kids. It's my turn. Kids, no, no. No, wait, kid, kid, can I get my, can I go first, please? Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. Hi. Oh, oh, almost in my head. Oh, that's just ridiculous. Yeah. Hey, kid, what's up? This is so cute. I love these things. Okay, let's get out of here. All right, guys. Well, that was basically the zoo I worked at. So, but we're not just, we're not done just yet. I still got one more thing to do, but yeah. Goodbye, zoo. Thanks so much for such a great summer. Even though I was only here two days a week, but it's all good. Goodbye.
What's up? How are you doing? I'm good. All right, these are my mates. They're for they're my friends from camp. Yeah, I'm, it's my last day vlog because I leave tomorrow right after I'm off to school. Are we gonna become like YouTube famous now? Yo, sub. Oh, to... yo, I I I finally figured out how to make money. Guess what my estimated revenue is? What is it? Eighty-one cents per per video. No, just in, in total. In total? Oh, not bad. That's almost enough to buy a candy bar. Oh, yeah, it is. Well, okay, I got in the video here. I do have an episode of Skyrim Saturdays. It's probably up right now. And don't worry, this is not the end of my YouTube career. Okay? All right, I'm going to make videos in college. It's not going to be easy, but I'm determined to do it. I love you guys to pieces. Peace.